this is Amy from Fitness Together. Um, this is part two of the three meals that you can make with the ground beef from the organic ground beef from Costco that I've already browned and cooked with seasoned with sea salt and chili powder. That's all I put in it. I don't use like the taco seasoning package or anything like that. Um, I'm gonna make spaghetti with zucchini and to organic tomato sauce and the meat. That's it. So if you haven't seen this contraption before, it is a, called a spiralizer. You can get it on Amazon for less than $30. Um, this particular one is courtesy of Kelly Murphy. She bought it for Ray and I because we lend out our personal one at the gym so that everybody can try a spiralizer to see if they like it. So let me show you how to use it. Um, it has different attachments. I'm using this attachment. This is going to make um, the zucchini look similar to how spaghetti actually looks. So you just put it in there and it's suction cup to the counter. So you just put the zucchini in there. You don't have to peel it unless you're trying to trick your kids. <laughs> I would peel it so that it doesn't have green. It'll come out looking more like spaghetti. So you just put it in there and you just start spiralizing. And I'm not putting a lot of pressure at all. This isn't hard. I'm not working hard at all. <laughs> it's really easy. And as you can see, it looks similar to spaghetti. I know it's not spaghetti, but you got to trick yourself sometimes. So you just keep on spiralizing. So that is a lot of spaghetti. Normally I would actually put this in a, a pot and just warm it up a little bit. You don't want to cook it too much because then the zucchini, zucchini gets mushy. Um, but I've already cooked everything so I just pour the spaghetti sauce on top. This is already hot. And then I put meat and you could make it all in one pot but I'm doing this for purposes of the video. So there you go, super quick, easy meal to make. If you already browned the meat, all you would have to do is heat up, uh, slice the zucchini, heat up the tomato sauce, and mix everything together. And that took me less than three minutes. So.